Um, I didn't know how to start. My family and friends wouldn't use me. So, I've learned a lot. I've got a great team behind me, and um, it's a lot of fun. I'm a people person as well. So. Okay. I train the new agents, um, and I manage our office staff. I'm starting to build a better referral business. Okay. Yeah, um, mostly I like doing listings because um, I and I get a lot of um, they just kind of come to me, but a lot of um, estate listings. So I've been doing this just over one and a half years. Okay. I believe since the beginning of this year, I've had 15 deals okay. as of right now. I have a pretty strong sphere and a pretty strong referral business. By the time of the, that that shift happened, we were down to 1250. So we had to build a system that allowed it that if our client didn't hear back to us within a month, we can get you the same day. And we're not tired. How do we get deals done? And the one big change that I saw this past maybe two weeks is issues on houses. What do you have to be at to know you're going to be okay? So looking at that, I knew my limit and I decided to grow a team at that point because I couldn't get over the 100 mark. They're like, well, let's go up here. Let's not. We can't do that. It's not worth that anymore. You have to have these skill sets. The numbers don't matter. It's right. the representation of what those mean. Right.